Reading self-improvement books without action is as good as building a plan without execution. When we wrap our heads around the idea that self-improvement books will get us the women that we want, the, the finances that we dreamed of, and the life that we need, we inevitably grow complacent in the comfort of our own home, expecting the days ahead to be easy. When I was getting familiar with talking to women, I would search up code approaching videos on YouTube in order to learn and gain some knowledge on how to properly code approach. By observing some of the successful people that had that code approach to successfully. I remember three days later, I actually went to code approach a woman. Um, that was very embarrassing. I stumbled over my words for a good 30 seconds or so before she declined me. When it's time to take action, however, most of us are postponed by our discomfort and anxiety, to which makes us ultimately seek comfort again in things like self-improvement books on a comfy couch. When we do decide to take action, however, we realize that some of the knowledge sticks while some don't. For example, if you were to code approach a woman and you learn that eye contact is a important indicator of romantic interest, you may find that that is true, but you may also find that completely fixed sentences like, like what is your hobby could be completely non-functional when it comes to picking up girls. So you need to go and test the knowledge that you have learned because you're not gonna yield results in the comfort of your own home, in the air conditioning, with a book in your hand. When you have truly tested your knowledge, you might find that certain parts of your knowledge is proven to be true and useful in most situations. And when you have become aware of this fact, you have acquired wisdom. Wisdom is applicable and repeatedly proven knowledge that is built through experiencing the world. For those who have not taken the discomfort, you may find that you are not grounded in your belief as you think you are, which results in you taking sides in arguments and not fully standing up for yourself, which is backed up by your own experiences and your own wisdom. A way to know that you have acquired wisdom is when you are able to articulate that wisdom to others.